Many pasta dinners were swallowed on this marathon eve, but the team sitting around this table at Luca on Hanover Street have a bond deeper than running. The team is running to help provide often expensive prosthetic legs to those who otherwise might not get them. And some of the athletes are amputees themselves. WBZ's Jim Smith has more now on the mission of 50 legs. <laughs> a last minute pre race dinner for a very special group of marathoners. The 50 legs team is raising money to help amputees get prosthetic legs. Carmen Acabo is the group's director. 50 legs helped her sister Celeste Corcoran get back on her feet after Celeste lost both legs in the marathon bombings. You know, she was initially fitted with some prosthetics that were very, very dated and um, virtually impossible for her to move in. And Steve Chamberlain and his organization reached out to us right away, came to visit Celeste in the hospital. They came and they told Celeste, we're going to get you these prosthetics. 50 legs has meant it's basically given her her life back. Steve Chamberlain lost one leg in a motorcycle accident and is founder of 50 legs. I thank God it happened to me every day to get to do what I do now. Get to meet amazing people. Um, the charity has been very good. I'm blessed enough to be able to help people get their lives back. Samantha Eddington is on the marathon team. 50 legs changed her 10 year old daughter Katie's life after Katie lost a leg in an accident when she was four. It means everything to her because she really loves to run. She's ran um, 18 5Ks and she's a national record holder in some sprints that she's competed in. And it's been an amazing experience for me to be able to give back just a little bit of what 50 legs has given to us. Marco Cicetto is also running Monday. A native of Kenya and a double leg amputee. I have at least what I need for now, but there are so many people out there who don't have what I already have. They have, you know, 50 legs have helped me to where I am. This is, you know, me giving back to the community. 50 legs has raised hundreds of thousands of dollars over the years. Long may they run. At the finish line, Jim Smith, WBZ News.